There's all kinds of money that goes out when you compete and it gets really expensive. Hey guys, I just got home from work and I want to show you guys, this is what Greg has been working on in the basement. So this is the um, bathroom down here in the um, basement in the AKA gym. So today he also put a knob there. We've got a toilet paper holder and I hope this doesn't blind you guys, but he found an LED pool light. That's awesome. And he painted it. It looks really good. I mean, for a basement bathroom. <laughs> hey guys, I'm home. I ate dinner. Digger's been fed. I've got my sweats on. I'm getting ready to head downstairs in the basement to do my back workout and maybe some cardio. I don't know. Um, but I wanted to get a good sweat, so I'm wearing sweats. But before Greg leaves me, out. he's eating popcorn. But, but. You stop right there. He just showed me a scratch on his belly. And he says there's something there. He said there's something there. I said, you son of a gun. You've been on Ashley Madison, haven't you? I'm just kidding. But, you know, whatever. You got a joke in life or you suck. Okay, I haven't actually connected this yet. This is a shark tooth Greg got me for Christmas and it works really well. Okay, so I just finished my um, back workout and yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> I guess I'm going to head upstairs and get a shower, get ready for bed and all that good stuff, but um, I know like it's a short one today. I had all my meals packed with me. I did um, have some tomatoes that Greg's aunt um, pulled from her garden, which I haven't had tomatoes from a garden since I was a little girl. My mom used to grow tomatoes, and there's something completely different about garden tomatoes versus tomatoes that you get in the store. I mean, they're just completely different. Um, and I missed that, and as soon as I cut into it, I was like, oh, I'm in heaven. <laughs> so that was really good today. Um, I had an, a pretty good day at work, actually. My nose is itching me like crazy right now. Um, I had a pretty good day at work, believe it or not. It's been really stressful, and I took Monday off because I was just already like so stressed. And today was a pretty good day, so that's good. I'm going into the weekend positive, getting my workouts in. Tomorrow is buys and tries. I'm going to do fasted cardio in the morning. That is the plan. And then Greg and I have some running around to do. And then I'll probably do buys and tries later and maybe some cardio. Um, because, you know, fall is right around the corner. Boots, jeans, you know. Girlfriend needs to be able to fit into her jeans because I've been living in yoga pants. And that is the truth. So, anyway, yeah, let me go upstairs and get ready for bed because it's like almost 10 o'clock. So, let me go. Okay, guys, so I just got out. out. I just got out of the shower and just getting ready to put on my night creams I'm using Garnier Moisturizing Rescue. So we're going to use some of that and uh, then we'll move on to some retinol cream and have some eye cream stuff. So that's what we're going to do. I was really having a hard time with getting down into the basement and getting my workouts done. And I still am, but maybe you guys can start holding me accountable. Maybe you can say, like, hey, Dawn, like, get your stuff together. It's just, I don't want to make excuses, but it, it's just really, really hard <laughs> with my work schedule 
And, you know, I mean, I know I've said it before, but, I mean, I leave the house at 6.30 in the morning. I don't get home until almost 8 o'clock at night. But, I'm not going to use that as an excuse anymore. So, my main thing is making sure that I'm getting downstairs and I'm at least, um, you know, getting my weight workout in. As long as I'm doing my weights, then I'm okay. But I'm going to try to make sure that I'm... <coughs> I'm going to make sure that I'm definitely getting my cardio in all my days off. And I'm going to try to do fasted cardio as much as possible. And I'm going to make sure I get my weight workouts in. Weight workouts are six days a week. So uh, just so you know what I'm doing, I am really going to concentrate on pretty much every muscle group. I'm going to give it its own day um, and its own attention. So what I'm going to do is Mondays will be shoulders, Tuesday is legs, Wednesday is chest, Thursday is abs, Friday, today, was the back, and tomorrow is buys and tries, and Sunday is a rest day. A rest day for weights, but I'll still do some cardio. Um, so that's kind of what the plan is. I wanted to compete this year, but with all the changes that have happened this year, it just really was not possible. Um, with the, us moving and we're still trying to put the house together and you know we're still going out and buying things for the house and I mean money let's be honest when you compete it's not cheap um, so you know just to kind of give you guys an example this is like a rough breakdown but it's like if I can remember correctly, I think it's like $150 for the NPC membership card thing, and that covers you for the year that we're in. So if you compete in a November show, then that's the only show that you're pretty much going to do. Um, so it's not like a rolling calendar. It's that specific calendar year. So $150 bucks for the card. Then I think it's like another 100 to enter in the um, competition. And then it may be like, and I could be wrong, I can't remember. It, I think it's like maybe like another 50 if I go into Masters. Um, and then you have your suit. So a suit can run you like, if you can get like maybe a used one, you're looking at maybe like $150 up um, to thousands of dollars. And, of course, you have to get your nails done, your hair done, waxing, shoes, not to mention if you're going to have a coach, you got to pay for your coach, posing coach. There's all kinds of money that goes out when you compete, and it gets really expensive. Um, and then paying for tan because you should tan before the show and then you need to pay for tanning like the day of and like the night before the show um that's not cheap that's like another hundred dollars gone <laughs> so it just just keeps adding up <laughs> so um so yeah it just wasn't feasible and i know a lot of people like open their like gofundme accounts i'm not a go Okay, so my camera died on me, so we'll go ahead and finish this up here. But basically, it's just not, it's not cheap. So it's a really expensive sport to get into, so I'm probably looking at next year. So this year right now, my focus is kind of building muscle um, and bringing my weight down some, but mostly muscle. Um... But because of where my weight is, there's no reason why I can't lose weight and gain muscle. And that is possible. Just in case you didn't know, you can do both at the same time. But anyway, let me go ahead and end this. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully this pimple is going to go down even more. This is 
annoying me so bad. Let's like talk about the elephant in the room, shall we? Not really. All right, guys. Good night. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below if you guys do out there. As always, I promise love you guys forever.